Here are three things you need if you're even thinking about moving to Thailand. Accommodation. You're either going to be stuck with hostels and hotels, which I don't really recommend. And then you can go into longer term rentals. Usually the average contract is about six to 12 months. Well, you're going to have your own place, to be honest. I say for an average apartment, you're looking at about three to four hundred dollars a month depending on obviously what area it's in and then for an average house for example mine is a three bedroom villa with a pool and jacuzzi that is seven hundred dollars a month and that's actually the fanciest most expensive house there is here in chiang mai the payments you're either going to need a wise card a multi-currency card so wise monzo revolut they all work you can use your home country's credit card, but you might get charged foreign transaction fees. If you're on an education visa, you can get a Thai bank, and that's just a cheat code. You can actually use that everywhere, and that you have no problems with money thereafter. You get free cash withdrawals and everything. And if you have any more questions, or you're interested in moving abroad, if you earn money online, or if you want to make money online, drop me a follow.